Monster life-threatening waves are hitting the north and west shores of most islands, and they're expected to build. Lifeguards are warning residents and visitors to keep their distance. Nikki Schenfeld reports. Well, the swell has picked up significantly since this morning. In fact, behind me was all dry sand and rocks early this morning, and now you can see it has turned into a complete tide pool. And now what's super concerning is that the swell and the tide are both continuing to rise throughout the evening, and that is leaving homeowners a little uneasy. The extra large swell has arrived life-threatening conditions out here. Um, it's not just an average high surf day, you know, so therefore ocean safety, uh, we're coordinating with the Department of Emergency Management. We're providing them with real-time shoreline updates and they will be assisting us uh, should we need to close roads or beach parks. Lifeguards put up caution tape across the North Shore to keep people away from the fast rising swell. This is precautionary. We do anticipate the swell to rise beyond these barriers. Um, and that's what's dangerous about a rising swell like this is it's unpredictable. Um, what you're looking at at one moment will be totally different in the next hour. This was Keiki Beach this morning at 830. And here it is seven hours later. You know, un unfortunately, from a like beach erosion, um, you know, flooding inundation aspect. The swell looks like it's probably going to peak right around the time of the high tide for here on, on the North Shore. So um, that is going to exacerbate that um, the destructive properties of this swell and, and that type of, you know, the flooding and things like that. Lifeguards warning people to stay off the sand and stay behind the caution tape. It's pretty gnarly out there. You got to be really careful. We were trying to take pictures before because we just got married yesterday. So you just don't know when it's going to come rushing up. Like, it looks calm, but then it's like, yeah, it's right? It just, it just comes and sweeps you right up. Parents of small children um, or people that are unfamiliar with these types of seasonal conditions to be very weary of where you stand, where you park your car, um, where you set your children down, uh, because it only takes a moment for the worst thing to happen. You can see the caution tape is still up. It's going to still be up tomorrow. It is still going to be really big in the morning and definitely only the experts should be out and we're going to follow up tomorrow to see if there is any damage and check up on all of these homeowners and we'll keep you updated with the very latest on friday for now from the north shore nikki schoenfeld k jones who news working for hawaii